Hello everyone, welcome back to a new episode <clears throat> of Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Last time we left off, we did some stuff in L Lurlin Village, and I would like to find the tower for this place if possible. The only problem being, I have no idea where it's at. Is that it? That's totally it, I think. Unless that's all the way over there and it's that tower. I don't know. Let's just pick a direction and go, why don't we? I don't think, uh... Xerxes is close enough to respond to my call. I think I left Xerxes down in, uh... The town or whatever. So, uh... Yeah, we'll, uh... We'll get to that. We'll get to that, I suppose. So we're huffing it for now. But, ooh. Well, that's convenient. That's mighty convenient of you. All right, let's go over here and hit this up then, and then we can just kind of glide where we need to go. Or I can I can ride this majestic beast. Do I have stealth up? I have the Yiga pants. I have the Yiga pants. Here we go. All right, let's see. Can I mount you? God, it would be so cool. Imagine if this was my steed. Uh-huh. No, you see me. Oh, okay. Okay. I might need to shoot you then, friend. Alright, what you got? Do you give me gourmet meat? Nope, just prime, really. Was gourmet like a chance to drop? I don't- I don't remember for the life of me. <clears throat> Alright. So, let's, uh, go hop on this. Now, it should just be like this, yeah? And then I should be able to ride it up pretty easily. Uh-huh. There we are. Okay, that is not the, the correct tower. That is the correct tower. <laughs> yeah, that one was way far away. Oh my god. Okay. Alright, that's fine. We'll be able to make it right over there. Which is, uh, certainly convenient. I gotta say, my, my way of traversing, which is, like, usually get up as high as I can and just fly places, it likely does have me listening, missing a lot of stuff in the environment. Like, what's that, what's that interesting stuff down there? And, uh, things like that. Because I'm not actually scraping the environment, I'm kind of just, like, jumping around, basically. So I've likely missed a ton of things. Uh... But, you know, in a game this big, I can't see and get everything. It's just not going to happen. I also have something weird going on with my ear today. Ever since I woke up this morning, my, like, left ear has basically felt like it needs to pop, but it won't. I don't know why. Ooh. It's not often that we see travelers here in such gloomy weather. Then again, everyone has their reasons for going places. It's not as though we ended up here by choice. In you know, Lurland Village, we used to live there. Yeah, I freed it, actually. You can you can go live there again. Small fishing town. You'll see it if you go southeast down the road and follow the signs. Ugh. It's not much to look at now after the monsters got to it. In the blink of an eye, they ruined the whole village. Restaurant my wife had just opened our house. Everything. Gone. Just came cruising in on their boat like a bunch of pirates, so that's what they're calling them, pirates. Going to the coast, be careful. You don't want them to spot you. I, I've already murdered all of them. Hello. Oh, are you a laborer for the Skyview Tower? I imagine that this rain makes your work rather difficult. Ah. My family used to live in Lurland Village, but a band of pirates ransacked the town. We escaped, barely, and fled here. I just opened a restaurant in the village, but it was destroyed like everything else. I used to pride myself on serving foods my customers had never tried before. Mm. Not getting my hopes up, but I'd sure love to return to Lurland Village and run my restaurant like before. Are these something I can collect? I feel like they are. They are. Okay, well, let's get a picture. Fleet Lotus. That just sounds like it makes me fast. Draw near deep water. The roots draw nutrients from the water, which boosts your movement speed when the seeds. Yeah, it just makes me fast. Deep water, you say? Is this water particularly deep? <laughs> it really doesn't look like it. But okay. This one's also growing out of a rock. Oh, it's because it's one of the rocks that fell. Yeah, that checks out. Uh, okay. So what are we dealing with here? Um, hmm. 
This is apparently something I have never grabbed before. Uh, can I... Um, Knight's Broadsword? Never mind. I've never picked up a Knight's Broadsword, but I have gotten a picture of it. Uh, well, we need some fire. Let's just, uh, do one of these, why don't we? Oh, did that not work? Weird. I see smoke. But, uh, it doesn't look like it actually did anything there. Huh. Weird. Hey. I said go away. Um... You can just, like, burn the stuff up, right? Ah, huh, apparently these don't care. Huh. What does that mean for me, then? Hmm. Let's see what this note says. Hudson Construction Expense Report. 10 pieces of wood, 120 rupees. I was cold from the rain, so I used them to warm up. Nobody called that a waste. 3 tents, 300 rupees. We needed a few more tents to keep the luggage and firewood dry in the rain, so I got them. Uh... Huh. How should I get rid of these things? Hmm. What does this say? This is just the note about the reconstruction project. I really thought you could just burn these things. Oh, maybe it's because it's- oh, it's because it's raining. Shit. Oh, yeah, that, that makes sense. That makes sense. It is raining. Hmm. So I need to figure out a different way to deal with them, huh? Hmm. Because it said the rain would make my work difficult, so I'm, I'm betting this is a location where it's just constantly raining. Uh, hmm. And I can't pick these up with sticky hand, right? I've seen them on shields before, but uh, you can't fuse it either. It doesn't seem like I can chop it. Hmm. I'm pretty sure that would work as a chop. That should work even in the rain. I mean, it's basically constantly burning it. There we go. Okay. That works. Yeah. Even if it's raining, this will work. Because I'm just constantly hitting it with fire. So the rain can't stop it. Hee 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 hee. Ho 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 ho. I am uh, the, the, the not that stupid. Can I squeeze past this and get in here now? I totally can. Yay. Alright, it was just as simple as spawning one of those. I thought, I was like, well, like, if I do a continuous flame, even a little bit of rain can't keep it down, right? I just can't start a fire. Which, uh, does make sense. <clears throat> Kablooey! There are probably many other ways to solve that, though, as is- as most things go in this game. Is that a- that's like an upside-down shrine. That looks pretty wild. Alright, well, I'm just happy to finally be revealing another big portion of the map. I don't think there was another, uh... tier over here. <clears throat> I don't remember. I do see that Korok, though. I don't know. Ooh, there's an island over there. Sky map updated. Cool, cool. Okay, um... Let's make sure we put on our... Better aerial control gear. There we go. And where do I want to go? Let's just stop for a quick second and kind of, uh, see here. Where are you? I wouldn't mind getting that island over there. What in the world is going on here? Why are there springs attached to this? What happens if I hit these springs? Is it just used to get up there? I guess so. Okay. I mean... That's fine. Low battery! Oh no! 
I don't want the low battery. Uh, I can plug my controller up really quick. There we go. I just get the cable here. Bonk. I did play like six hours of Dokopan yesterday, so... Checks out that my controller's a little bit low on battery here. Uh, alright, so... From here, I mean... Hmm. I don't suppose I could just... I, I can't. Cool. Because I'm kind of interested in what's up here, and I'm kind of interested in what's on that island. Uh, so... I find myself wanting to go over there and explore. Uh-huh. Well, what is the deal uh, with you? Huh. Hmm. Okay. You're interesting. I mean, I could just make like a flying spaceship out of these things, which I probably will do soon. But, um, for right now, I'm... Oh, they always level out? Ah, that's unfortunate. Okay. Well then, we're just gonna have to grab this and move it over here, aren't we? Because I think... I want this right here. Attach. Yeah. That was on an inconvenient spot, I believe. There we are. Alrighty, and this should shoot me up high enough to get me to where I want to go. There we go. Yeah, right over here. This is basically where I want to be. Or probably want to be up there, actually. That's probably where I want to be. There's a shrine over there and everything. Um, we got a little Zonai corpse here. What is this shroom? Endura. Ooh. Thank you. Won't lie to you, um, go Ghost Sedan kind of scared me there. Oh, hey, there's a construct over there, too. Okay, that's, uh, that's neat. Um, can I reach those from down here? I cannot. There is no way. I do believe I have some springs. I could just do that. Or we could make a big dumb vehicle. Okay, here here's my steed of choice. Let's go. Oh, it's it's fast it is. Oh yeah, it's a quick one. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, we're getting where we need to go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, don't worry about me. We got places to be, things to do. Oh, this is not gonna work. Oh, this is not gonna work. Uh, huh. Let's at least make it over here. Then I can just jump up. <laughs> it's been a minute since I've made a stupid dumb vehicle, so I wanted to make a stupid dumb vehicle. And you know, I did. And now I've had my fun. And now we can do that to just get over here easily. Okay. Well, uh, that is cool. There's a bunch of, uh, Zonai dead down here. Zonai corpses. Or construct corpses, rather. Alright. So, hit me. Okay, and the, the crystal is down there with the constructs. We're doing this whole rigmarole again, aren't we? Yeah. Kuma main shrine. Hit me with it. Take the crystal connected to the beam. I would have never thought. I would have never thought. Alright, yep. So, the Nakluda Sky Crystal. Let's, uh, finish grabbing all of our stuff from over here. Oh, hi, hi, Burb. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to disturb you. Alright, we got a bunch of Zonai charges, so we can go over here and see what this gotcha has in it. Hit me with your beautiful, beautiful gotcha. I do have quite a fair few more of these. 
Oh yeah, people also mentioned uh, the music that I was freaking uh, freaking out about because I thought they were associated with the construct because it kind of sounded like w mechanical and whimsical, I guess. That's just the horse music. Small wheel, powered zone eye device that spins quickly and is best suited for flat surfaces. It doesn't handle hills or even bumps very well. Oh, is that the gun? That's the gun! Shot explodes when hitting the target. It's a powerful device, but it can be tricky to get firing angle just right. Oh, I have an idea I want to try for the- for the gun. Okay, we need- we need more guns. We need more guns. <clears throat> we definitely, definitely need more guns. You know? Yeah, 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 yeah. There we go, there we go. Come on. American Link, let's go. Link's like, I need guns. I need them all. I need an entire collection. Uh, one more group of five. But I I have an idea for gun that I like and seems like a fun idea. Ooh, we got three gun. Three gun. Okay. How, how many is that? How many is that? That is eight. Eight cannons. I'm good with that. I'm good with that. I probably got everything else in there too. So, my idea is cannon on ground fuse mighty zonite shield <laughs> yes it works exactly how i thought it would <laughs> oh yeah oh i'm ready now i'm ready all right let's go what do we got? Shock fruit? Ooh, shock fruit. Um... What else do we got here? Uh, bust and bulb. Let's see. Then, yeah, I need to get over there. Okay, so let's go over here. And what do we got? What is this? Um... Guessing I'm su well. I thought I was supposed to use that to get over here, but no. Okay, well the crystal stuck to your head, so. Um. Hi, friends. Flex construct three. Uh oh. That seems mighty intimidating. It does. Uh, Sedan, where are you at? Bubble, please. Thank you. Okay, so where's your... Where's your thing? Uh-huh. Ow. I see it. Here it is. Give me your head. Here it is. Got it. Ooh, are you moving? I think you're moving. Ooh. Okay. Give. That's mine now. Yeah, you move it, depending. Bang, 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 Okay, that was pretty good. It's pretty good. My hammer's still doing big damage, right? Yeah, that 58 damage. Oh, there it was. Uh-huh. Up. Uh. No. Uh. Uh. Stop it. Uh-uh. Oh, there it is. Ah. Gotta be quick on the draw. I get it? I got it. Uh-huh. Attack Sidon! Do it, you fool! Oh, my hammer broke. Um... Yeah. Ow. Okay, we're doing a little bit better with this one, though. Uh, uh-oh. Ow! Okay, yeah, you know, that hurts about as much as I thought it would. Um, unfortunately, I'm not super prepared for this and don't have a lot of good food. Another hit like that and I'm a little bit boned. Okay, we've learned... yeah, 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 this is what I need to do. Ah, but you're not close enough. Oh wait, no, 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 we've learned... yeah, 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 we, we do this. We do this. Okay, and then I, and then I ride one up. Right? Yeah. <clears throat> yes. This is how it goes. Uh-huh. Eat it, nerd. 
I broke it. Uh huh. Spin. No! So close. Okay. Um, can I hurt it by shooting it with just like a bomb arrow, I wonder? Does that work? It knocks you down, yes. Okay, that does kind of work. Because you don't have that much HP left, so. <laughs> I think I'm about to die. Um. Uh, sure, we'll, we'll eat some icy meat. I don't need this right now. Okay. Okay. I see it. Um. Wrong thing. <laughs> Give. It's mine. Yeah. Come here, you bastard. <laughs> I did it. That was fun. That was fun. That one was that one was pretty crazy. Oh my god, that's gonna make an absurd weapon. Um uh, refuse sneak strike, wind razor, wind razor. Um let's see. Captain 2 Reaper. Captain 2 Blade. I mean it makes the most sense to put a Zonite device on let's see. Um Let's grab... Let's see. Let's see. Resonates with attached Zonite devices. Yeah, so I think... I have a strong Zonite sword. Okay. Strong Zonite sword plus Captain Construct Zonite so Zonite long sword. So I think I want this. So let's destroy the fused material on this. Um, switch to it. And I want to fuse... You. <laughs> I like how I didn't even use my cannon shield that whole time after freaking out about it. Okay, that's a pretty strong weapon, though. But, uh, yeah, I wonder if the cannon shield would have, uh... Possibly been able to hit it? I was kind of thinking, like, oh, it probably can't hit it. It's kind of hard to aim, too. But, uh... That might have been a good thing to use on it. But, whatever. Whatever. Here I was freaking out about my cannon shield. Meanwhile, d didn't even use it when it might have been useful. <laughs> Uh, okay. Yeah, now the question is, how do I, how do I get you back over there? That becomes the new question. <clears throat> Which, there's like a little thingy over here, I think might work. We'll, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll fuck around with this and see if we can, if we can do something here. Because I'm imagining maybe this will work. Right? Uh huh. Like that. And then we put me and this in there. Maybe. Ah! Well, it made it over there. Um, I did not mean to attack. Did not mean to attack at all. Just gonna whack with this. Here. I did not mean to accidentally accidentally hit the button. That was my bad. Okay, but hey, our thing's over there. There we go. Cool. Now we just gotta now we just gotta bring it over. Come on, you. All right, that wasn't so bad. And maybe I'll maybe I'll be able to test my cannon out on other things. You know. Let's go throw this in here and then see what we can do. <clears throat> What's that over there? Oh, that's just... I thought that was some kind of crazy new construct. But no, it's just the thingies. It's just the thingies. Yeah, 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 yeah. I've got to get used to actually having like a... Like using my shield more. I'm so used to using two-handed weapons that I regularly forget that my shield exists, but now that I have a cannon shield, I need to... I need to keep that in mind. That's say you can press down to call summoned friends? I think it's what it said on that loading screen. Like, you can tell them to form up on you. Oh, thank you for the Zonite bow. I did need another one of those. They're quite useful with that extra range, and all you lose is energy. <clears throat> Good for hitting far-off targets. I just remember there was a Korok I saw earlier. That I have not grabbed. 
We can also up our HP or whatever we want. That's a thing that can happen. Yeah. All right. Coo, coo, coo. So, yeah, I have the eightfold long blade out. Let's get the flux core pounder. All right, so where do I want to head now? There's that over there, which I am fairly interested in. Um, uh, can you just push it this way? You can. So, no. A little bit more that way. I want to see if I can make it to that island over there. There. So let's see. Let's uh, let's do a little cursory jump here. We that is not gonna get me over there. Um, it might get me to the island, like actually on the ground. It's not gonna get me to the island up in the sky, though. Actually, I don't think it's gonna get me to either one. That's a hard island to get to. Hmm. I mean, I can dive, and we can see if maybe we can make it work, but I severely doubt it. That's very, very far. Is that the island, like, where you go there and you have to, like, basically defeat everything on the island just with the stuff that's available there? Because that was, like, one of my favorite challenges, and I don't particularly remember where it was. That might be it. I want to say it was at, like, the bottom one corners of the map or something like that, so... That could very well be it. I can't remember the name of that island, unfortunately, because my memory is... Garbaggio, but, uh... Let's go see what this island is. If this was Super Mario Sunshine, there would be a golden, uh... Golden sun... Uh, uh, shine Sprite bird that patrols this island. I mean, I could make myself a boat from this island. There's actually already a boat here. There's many boats here? Hi? Huh. Interesting. And what is that? Oh, that's one of those. Okay. Okay, well, I know what it wants me to do here. That's for sure. Um, there are rockets over here, which I can use to just pull out the thing, I think. Um, I just need a good way to get over there and actually connect it. So, yeah, let's do that, and there were a few fans, so I could put a fan on there. Um, I also have a steering wheel, so why not? Here we go. That should be enough. There we go. Let's get you on there, and uh, control stick. Also go down. There we go. And let's bring the rocket with us. Not attach it. Just drop it in there. Because I'm just going to attach the rocket to the cork. And we will go. This is a very slow vessel, but... It'll do us for now. Alright. Hey, there's porgies over here, too. Okay. So... What I want to do now is attach this, like, to that, there, and then I probably want to back up a little bit, let's, let's back, back up a little, can we, uh oh, I guess we only really move forward, huh? Uh, so let's just do one of these. Let's put you over there. Alright, and then we hit you with one of those. There we go. Yeah, ha, ha, ha. Yep, yep. Alright, so cool. Here we go, we're done. And uh, now I can get on my boat. And we'll be able to make our way over to the island over there next time, so...
yeah, I think we'll go ahead and end things off here. Made a pretty good amount of progress, so hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you next time for some more.